Hey, what's going on guys? As you guys know, I am True Trees, and today I want to talk to you guys about stained clay. A lot of people have been wondering what everything is going to be. Oh my, dude, I cannot concentrate when this huge slime... Dude, get out of my, get out of my way, dude, come on. Don't, don't interrupt the camera. We're filming a movie here, guys. Please, please, please just let us, let us be. Um, but anyways, a lot of people have been wondering if we were going to be getting stained clay or not. Um, we did see some images on 4J Studios. They released it. I actually made some videos about it um, earlier, talking about stained clay, whether if it was just uh, like a, a gold block or if it was actually a stained clay. Um, it was like either one of these things or an actual gold block. So it's kind of interesting. And um, personally, I, I honestly think that we will be getting stained clay. Um, just because, I mean, I don't really see why not. It's really not too much of a deal to add it to the game. Of course, it, adds, it gets a little extra work in, but um, honestly, I don't think it's really too bad for 4 days to put it in. It won't take too much coating. But anyways, um, the difference between, like, stained clay, or, like, stained colored clay, I should say, and, um, like, different wool. If, if you guys have ever dyed wool before, you guys know that wool is not that strong. If You guys, you can set fire to it, and it really breaks really easily. Um, clay, I mean... It, it's not too, too strong, however, it's a lot stronger than getting wool, and uh, you're better off making a colored house out of stained clay rather than um, actually making it out of wool, because you just it's kind of like the three little pigs. I mean, your house really stands no chance. Dude, you're making me really uncomfortable, man. You gotta stop jumping in my videos, jeez. Um, well, anyways, for you guys to make it, it's really simple. All you need is clay. Um, you can find it really easily on the map, and uh, just go in your furnace quick, and uh, just put clay in here and it's gonna burn it up real quick here so I'll give it a couple of seconds and um, while I'm waiting for that I'm actually going to quick get a uh, crafting table and I'm on the PC if you guys cannot tell obviously because of the mouse and I'm on the PC kind of to show to you guys um, what it takes to get the stained clay so it makes hardened clay right here so I'm gonna let that cook for a little bit so you guys can see what that looks like um, and it's really simple all you really need is hardened clay as well as dye. I mean, you can get dye uh, really easily to you from the world. Um, man, you guys are really, really, really noisy out here. Jeez. You know what? I don't, I don't want to... Next time I film, I think I'm going to make a huge dome. So uh, these slime peasants <laughs> don't, don't interrupt me. You guys are really distracting. All right. So once you guys have enough hardened clay, you want to take that. And then you just want to move over to the crafting table. And then uh, what you want to actually do is you want to put the hardening clay around it. Of course, you don't have to worry about this manual crafting uh, because we are going to be getting the uh, regular automatic crafting for us. So there we have it. We have the uh, the clay surrounding the lime dye, and then we have lime stained clay. So now we can put that down, and then we can put that on our house here. Um, it kind of it's pretty similar to the grass color. I don't know, it's kind of cool. Uh, but anyways, I mean you can try it with different dyes, do different things. Uh, but overall, it's kind of cool and uh, mix and match make some pretty colorful houses if you wish and um, Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you would please smack the like button if you guys are excited for the next title update Smack the like button show some support to the minecraft community and uh, we'll catch you guys later until next time Have a fantastic day stay true